Hi everybody, it's Ms. Tibble. I want to go over with you how to use the online construction tools which can be found at mathspad.com. So on your browser you'll want to type in mathspad.com or you can type online compass tool and the mathpad should pop up for you. Once you're in this website um, you're going to see there are several tools. I think to start with I'd like you to just focus on the main ones. So um, the segment tool. So if I click on the segment tool you'll see that it um, highlights uh, the other ones are all purple. The segment tool that I just clicked on is uh, yellow. So to use the segment tool I'm going to go ahead and just draw a segment. I'm going to go ahead and use the segment tool to draw an angle. Okay, um, that's the segment tool. Now down below you're going to see I'm going to click on the undo button. When I click on the undo button what happens is whatever I put on my screen is going to disappear. So the last thing I did is going to suddenly be erased. And uh, now I want to focus on another tool, the pencil tool. So I'm going to click on the pencil. Notice that it became yellow. And the pencil is to just write on the board. Okay, so you can see I wrote the word hi and a smiley face. If I want to undo that, I'll go to the undo button, click on it until everything has been undone that I want to erase. The other tool that you're going to use, uh, this tool here is very important, it's the compass. So let's click on the compass. When I click on the compass, um, you'll see that a compass suddenly appears on your screen. It might take a little bit of practice um, for you. You're going to notice that to drag the compass around you're going to have to drag it by the, um, the, the part of the compass with the pointy part opposite the pencil. So you can see I can drag the compass around And if I want to widen the compass, I go to where the pencil is and I can widen the compass. Once I've gotten it to as wide as I want it to be, I can lock it. So I click on the lock button. And then I, if I want to actually make a circle or an arc, I go to the very top part of the compass notice what I'm doing there. So I may make it an arc. If I keep going I will have made a circle. If I want to rem you know, drag that compass I have to drag it by the part where the pointy part of the compass is. That might take a little getting used to so you'll want to practice using the compass tool. If I want to um, unlock the compass so that I can create a different arc or circle. Click on the lock. Uh, decide how, you know, maybe if I want to make a really small circle. Um, I'll lock it again. Go to the very top to, to go ahead and draw. And there you have it. Those are the main tools um, that you'll be using for now. So I think as an introduction, I want you to just practice using the compass, the pencil, the segment tool. And that is it. Please let me know if you have any questions.